Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to episode 13. Uh, unlucky for some, hopefully not me. Uh, not real sure what we're going to um, do this episode, but basically I'm heading out to Auckland for a couple of days to stay at my aunt and uncle's place with my mum. Um, I've got some meetings and stuff to get done and I'm uh, going to go catch up with some people, get some filming done, obviously go and get some pizza, stuff like that. Um, and mum's off to see a show with her sister, my aunt, so we're going to go stay there and probably pick up some stuff from the farm. Uh, maybe go for a little look around there and uh, yeah driving over the Kaimais in a moment so hopefully we keep all of our wing mirrors quick stop in Meta Meta um, yeah easy drive over the Kaimais I was going to try and get you some footage but then I thought wow if I do something stupid then you sort of call me out on it so but I didn't we survived it's fine have both wing mirrors intact mum's having a cigarette Or something um, and I got some food from a bakery uh, I think next stop will be my aunt's house hello I'm, I'm giving mum shit about the fact that her cigarette stinks so she keeps for breezing herself say hi to all the people on YouTube mum oh, sorry oh hello good morning She's fucking posh, eh? <laughs> it's not how she normally talks, but it's certainly not how she talks when she's drunk. Made it back to Cow Cop. Not too bad a drive. Pretty chill. Um, yeah, fun times. I think the thing, like, driving back, though, has kind of made me think about is, like, how far it is to come each time I need to come back to Auckland for something work-related, which kind of leads me into a little bit of something that I've been thinking about for the last couple of weeks which is I don't know if I want to stay in Tauranga long term. Um, I mean, everything's up in the air at the moment until a house gets rebuilt, sold, all that kind of crap. But um, I just think from, in terms of from a work point of view, um, like everything kind of happens in Auckland, but I don't really want to be in Auckland. So it's really just going to be a case of if we can find a space that we can make our own where we don't have to deal with the outside world, but is also helpful for getting work done and content creation and all that kind of stuff, then like that's potentially cool, but it really just depends on how big I can make the empire like within the next kind of 12 to 18 months. Um, which really, we just have to wait and see. So make sure that you like everything that we post on Facebook and read all our articles and subscribe on YouTube because all of that stuff helps. It's all really helpful. So uh, yeah, anywho, uh, we'll check in shortly. The house. Basically the whole thing's gutted, all the carpet's been pulled up. Didn't actually realise we had hardwood hardwood floor throughout the whole place. That's kind of a cool thing to find out. Um, but yeah, no, it's, it's weird being back here, eh? Like, this doesn't feel like my house anymore. At all. But um, neither does the house in Tauranga. I feel kind of like homeless, I guess. Um, no, it's a strange feeling. But anyway, yeah, so this is the house that's still standing. What's left of it. And uh, yeah, a couple of months. Maybe six to nine months and it'll be brand new, ready for someone else to buy, and then, then I'll figure my life out. Mum does have her occasional funnies, like if I say if we're going somewhere, like if I'm taking her out, they're like, you're coming, she'll be like, no, I'm just breathing heavily. One day, in about a year from now, this house will be brand new, spanking, clean, and finished, and it will make somebody very happy. So if anyone actually wants to buy this house, hit me a message and I'll um, do you a good rate. See out there, there's like 25 acres of lovely green land. Uh, yeah. That smell, it doesn't smell anywhere near as bad as it did, but I guess there's plenty of ventilation considering that there's a big hole in the roof. Yeah, it's still it still like smells it's though. Morning all, it's a Sunday morning and I'm 10 minutes late for a very important meeting. Um, I'm in Arua and I'm, oh, actually, firstly, look at Trevor. Isn't Trevor amazing? Oh hi. Oh hi. Dirty smokers. How you been? Good mate, how you been? Good, how's Taranga? Uh, I don't think I'm going to stay. No? No. Oh, this is the least. Dirty smoker. Um, Very dirty bacon though, I think. Um, anyway, today we've got a very important top secret meeting at uh, Matt Jordan, ship shaped tattoo. Um, I haven't actually been here since I had my leg done by Steve. That's right. 
Anyway. Yeah, that was a long time ago. We need to do a quick car check on Matt's new truck. This just came over from the States. His name's Trevor. Trevor 2.0. So yeah, there's interesting stuff coming and you need to keep an eye out for the common good. It's going to be awesome. How are you manually there? <laughs> you guys remember Jaden? Hashtag that's my boyfriend. His boyfriend. Also my boyfriend. Dibs. Hello. Oh. Actually, you guys haven't met Matt before. I don't think Matt's ever been in a webisode. We're having a meeting at Ship Shape Tattoo about some super cool stuff that Matt's kind of pioneered and we've all jumped on board with because it's super exciting, it's going to be super cool. And I had to get up early on a Sunday. What to do? I need to have a conversation with you off camera about what this girl did to me last night. Oh, get it, girl! Did she go back into it? Uh. All right, so that was a good meeting over at uh, our ship shaped tattoo. And now, Did you? yeah, I'm going there on Tuesday. I'm in the middle of vlogging. Do you mind? <laughs> anyway, now the second part of today is to come down and see the wonderful Ivana. Um, and she's got new digs. Um, we're going to do some vlogs, some dating vlogs, because both of us are really bad at it. So you can learn from our mistakes. But Ivana's got new digs. Oh look, dance and yoga studio and a fancy room so ladies can come and do ladies shit. I have no idea what happens in here, obviously. This is the beauty room, so Nick doesn't fit into this room whatsoever. There's a lot of things I don't fit into. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it started already, it started already. It's going to be a filthy vlog, isn't it? Yeah. Oh dear. Anyway, so yeah, so we're going to smash out some vlogs, um, and you can see those on the exact same YouTube channel, they will just be in a different playlist. Um, and yes, yeah, so we're going to do that while we're motivated, because you didn't get much sleep, and I didn't get much sleep. Poor old Ivan is tired. I just got home old. from work. And I didn't get much sleep, because I was living at a fucking funny farm. <laughs> you know Noah's Ark, how he had two of everything. My aunt and uncle have five of everything, minimum. Oh, lovely. And they're all very noisy all the way through the night. Get motivated, do some vlogs, and then you guys can laugh at our misfortune when it comes to dating. Yeah, I reckon we should do one on getting stood up, because that happened a couple of weeks ago. I can't believe anybody would stand up on her up. I mean, look at it. Like that. <laughs> look. I didn't get stood up last night, but that's a different story. <laughs> Which we'll probably touch on. <laughs> touch being the operative word. That's exactly what I was going to say. Bad touch. <laughs> and we appreciate the shit out of subscribes. Thank you. Bye. See ya. Okay, it's off now. Funny, <laughs> funny girl. No. So, yeah, we did our vlogs, uh, we smashed out two, so they will be up on YouTube when I get around to editing them and putting them on YouTube, uh, which thankfully I can do very quickly now because I have fibre at home, which is amazing. 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 Anyway, Ivana's going to do some work, and I very nearly fell asleep on the couch because I'm tired. I'm boring, because I'm that boring. Well, I didn't want to say it like that, but yeah, I mean, that's the gist. That's right people, it's a webisode, we're in Auckland, so we're at Sal's. You guys remember Shan from the old webisodes, I did a very successful job of picking her up at the Rebel Trolley Derby, and she still loves me. In fact, in fact, Shan is going to move to Tauranga to marry me. <laughs> yeah. Lovely. And we also have, those of you that have been following for a long time, remember Matt? From back in the NZ Blokes days, we've missed him. He's <laughs> and Alex. 
Alex won the uh, No Man's Sky giveaway because he bribed me with a blowjob, which I am looking forward to getting. Anyway, we're just waiting on Cam and we're going to order some pizza. Care pressure, care pressure. I'm not doing a wheelie. Do a wheelie. It's illegal. So is doing. Yes, doing wheelies are illegal. So is doing 180 kilometres an hour on the motorway to get here, Sean. I'll do that. <laughs> 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 There's There's no of this. The ultimate, the ultimate peer pressure. I bet you can't. I bet you're too scared. The I'm old Sean would have done it. <laughs> I'm totally too scared to do a wheelie. I can't even ride. This is. Let's go have a look at Sean's bicycle. Why does your tank a different colour to the rest of your bike? Special edition. Is that the racing edition or is that the I fell off my bike edition? It's Hampton Downs edition. <laughs> I'm so glad that we're getting married. I can't wait. I can't wait to stop having sex. I'm going to make sure that I've got a nice leather suit, dress. Yeah, leather is good for things to wipe off. For what? Nothing. shopping uh, I'm gonna go stop at a playtex see the people there and grab some bits uh, I've just been getting some week work and emails done on my wonderful Lenovo laptop this thing is a powerhouse I can do video editing on this laptop which is super awesome because then when I go away I can actually make and upload videos while I'm away which is a kick-ass yeah, this, this one is a Y700 ThinkPad And it kicked ass for gaming too. We were actually playing some Counter Strike last night, so. <laughs> and I hit the best frame rate out of everyone. Quick haul from Playtech. It was a bit of an in and out, so I didn't get much time to stop and look around. Um, but the, one of the things that I bought was the LED pack for my GoPro, so I can, when I'm, it's particularly uh, handy for if I'm setting up a static shot, like with Ivana's vlogs yesterday, I can use this and actually frame it really nicely and then I don't get complaints from Ivana that you, know, you can see my ankles and things of that nature um, and it's also got a touch screen on it so you can do all of the um, adjustments and stuff from that and then make it look perfect so that's a handy one and the other one that I bought uh, the other thing that I bought is a Razer Siren um, the reason that I bought this is because I've been having a lot of issues lately with audio, trying to do product reviews, um, and yeah, from what I've read, they're really great, they're up there. Um, I didn't buy, oh, actually, there was two options, it was the Razer Siren or I could have got the Razer Pro, and the Pro was an extra hundred and something dollars, um, and the only real thing that it did was, um, it had an XLR adapter, which I wouldn't use, um, at this point anyway. Um, and it had a low pass filter which I can do in post production anyway so that's fine um, so I just yeah so I went for the cheaper of the two options um, so then yeah that, that's gonna be good to make it sound really nice on streams and if I'm doing like a like a shot where I'm sort of doing product reviews and stuff like that it should sound really good straight into the laptop into OBS no problems so um, yeah uh, gonna go have a nice lunch with mum and mum's friend and down in St Helier's and probably be very expensive and then we will drive our asses all the way back home to Tauranga. So I uh, hope you enjoyed this webisode, it's been a bit of a mishmash, sort of all sorts of bits and pieces. Um, if you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up, if you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. If you want to see the next one, make sure that you hit the subscribe button. Um, I don't know what the next one's going to be, but we'll find out next time. Alright, 